Let's have the vote. I propose we give the Reverend a chance. At least see how she does on Sunday. Right. All those in favour of Mr. Newitt's excellent proposition. Bravo. Oh. All those against? Oh, this is ridiculous. All I can say is that the proof of the pudding will be in the eating. I think you will find that our little community does not react well to the indignity of a vicar in high heels and rallies behind me in the desire to keep up the traditions that have made this village and the Church of England what they are today. I take it that's a no? <laughs> yes. God, your father's handsome when he's angry, isn't he? <laughs> In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. <laughs> I'd like to start by singing zippity doo -dah because it is such a thrill to see so many of you here. But I think we should stick with tradition and sing hymn number 199. <laughs> I know a lot of you were surprised to find that your vicar's a woman. Not as surprised as me. All the way through my teens, I was convinced that, naturally, I would become a supermodel and marry either Eric Clapton or David Soul, as you do. And then one day, I read the Sermon on the Mount, and it was so fantastic, that was it. I decided there and then to abandon the catwalk and give the dog collar a try. So, here I am, at your service, totally yours, any time, any day. Although if you come to see me first thing in the morning, wear dark glasses. Because before my face falls into place, I look frighteningly like Bernard Manning. <laughs> no, it's true, I do, it's scary. <laughs> now, let's sing hymn number 300. And I always think it sounds best if you shout on the bread of heaven bit. <laughs> Marks out of ten, Alice. Seventeen. Uh, come in. Oh, Owen, what did you think? Missed most of it, I'm afraid, oh. otherwise engaged. Oh, stomach's still bad. To be frank, it's like the Battle of the Somme down there. Oh, sorry. Jim, did you enjoy it? No, 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 no. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> well, you'll definitely be staying on now. Oh, oh yes, you yeah. will. Oh. Fingers crossed. No, it's dead, sir. Mm. I haven't been more certain of anything since I opened the envelope telling me how many O-levels I'd passed. Mm. And how many did you pass? None, I'm afraid. <laughs> it, it's the most people we've had in the church since that Lady Godiva thing three years ago. Oh, what was that? Oh, we were celebrating the summer solstice and we thought it'd be fun to reenact Lady Godiva. No, 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 it's my dress. <laughs> A lot of people turned up, but unfortunately it was rather disappointing. Lady Godiva wearing a body stocking. No. She was absolutely stark naked. Wow. Uh, well, I hadn't had time to go to the hairdresser, so I wasn't looking my best. I bet you were, you saucepot. 